Hi, this is Joanna Stern of Laptop Magazine, and I'm here at CES 2009. We're getting a look now at Dell's newest netbook. This is the Dell Inspiron Mini 10. Dell's building out their family of netbooks. We've seen the Mini 9, and now we're going to see, and we've seen the Mini 12. Now we're going to get a look at what differentiates the Mini 10. So we have here the Mini 9 on top of the Mini 10. As you can see, the Mini 9 uh, is a little bit shorter in length. But let's take a look at the nice compact size of the Mini 10. Again, it's a very nice and sleek lid here. We've got a white and it's going to come in a black option. So a nice size, very compact form as we're used to seeing with this 10-inch option. Uh, it has a 3-cell battery in right now, but will be available with a 6-cell. So it could have a little bit of a, a back here, but right now very flush system and very compact. So open up here. Uh, just to give you some highlights here on the keyboard, Dell has actually extended the keyboard on this system. It's bigger than both the uh, Mini 9's keyboard and the Mini 12's keyboard, actually. So uh, we're definitely seeing a nice feedback on the keys. Uh, shift keys bigger than we saw in the Mini 9, uh, as well as we have that full row of function keys on the top, so that's also a differentiator. Uh, nice move here on the trackpad. Uh, it's reminding us a bit of the new MacBooks, where you don't have any buttons. This is a actually a full trackpad here, so the mouse buttons, the right and left, are inside the pad. Uh, we can show you a little how that works, but nice feedback here, and don't necessarily miss the buttons on the bottom just quite yet, but we need a little bit more time with that. Up to the display, you've got a flush 10-inch display. We really like that they've uh, gone without the bezel. It's similar to what we've seen on the HP Mini 2140. Uh, nice look, and they'll also offer a, a high-definition option. Also, in terms of talking about the form, we're looking right now just at the ports around the system. Right here, you've got a USB port, a micro, um, a memory card reader slot. I think it's three in one. And you flip on over to the system. The other side, you've got a few uh, unique ports here. You've got a head and microphone jack, the HDMI, which is definitely unique for a system like this, and two USB, um, and then an Ethernet here. As for the specs, we're not really sure yet what the configuration options will be, uh, but we do know that it will have some extra features that we haven't seen on many netbooks to date. Uh, the first is a GPS option, so that would be pretty cool. You can maybe pop this in your car and use it as a nav navigation device. Taboo would also have a mobile broadband option integrated, uh, and on top of that, it'll have a TV tuner option on many of the SKUs. Uh, no word yet when that will come to the U.S., but that could be a pretty cool option to pop in a TV tuner and watch this on the go. So this was a first look at the Dell Inspiron Mini 10. Definitely looking forward to seeing this 10-inch netbook from Dell. Uh, look forward to seeing it in the future. And again, Joanna Stern from Laptop Magazine.